Hey guys, it's the mid -Age Gamer, and uh, I just thought I'd uh, alert you to a new feature in uh, YouTube. Now, you know I've had a long-standing problem with the content ID system in you that YouTube uses because it's heavy-handed and has a lot of false positives. Um, but that said, I think they're trying to meet us halfway here. Now, what I've done is uh, I've actually purposely uploaded, it's privately now, but purposely uploaded a video that has what I know to be copyrighted content on it. And of course when you have that, of course you see this little match third party content thing next to your video. In fact, I go to Video Manager on my page here and there it is. It'll show up just like that. What that means when you've got that is that you can't monetize, you can't pretty much nothing and you, you, you've got a fight on your hands. But instead of having to pull the video down or completely re-edit it, they have a, kind of a middle of the road compromise option that just showed up. I'm going to go ahead and hit edit here because if I go straight, if I just click this link, see I'm going to go straight to the acknowledge dispute, copyright dispute. Well, I'm not even going to bother with this. But if I go into edit, we'll edit the video, and since it's, I know it's an audio thing that it's upset about, I'll go to audio, And here we see it says we detected your video as copyrighted audio. Okay. Well, we can fix it by removing the song. And what we'll do is it, it knows where the song is and it lists it in the video. And in this case, I used Van Halen's 1984 and a portion of Jump. And what will happen is you get these two songs. All you gotta do is remove them as so. You press save. Okay. So now you see this screen, and what it does is it's going to process the video. And when you come back to it, when it's done processing it, you'll actually be able to go ahead and go on back and, and monetize it, and edit it, do whatever you want because the offending content will be gone. So we'll, we'll go here, we'll go ahead and go back to the video manager. And while that's happening, you can see the edit in progress. So it's kind of a workaround. I mean, it'll actually selectively go through the video and take out the offending content. Um, in fact, this video right below it, this Battlefield 4 spoilers, had this problem. And I removed whatever offending content it was. And it was fine and let me monetize and, un and, and happy. That said, the content it had was embedded music in the game that I wasn't even aware of. And the thing is, the content ID system should have never flagged it, but it did. Um, like I said, I'm not against anybody having that, having having rights to their copyright, but uh, the fact was that that is definitely a transformative use and not meant as a public performance. But you know, that's copyright law for you. In any case, that's my little soapbox moment for this. Anyway, just know that you do have a way around of uh, you know getting rid of so-called copyrighted content if it's a problem and getting your videos monetized and that kind of thing. All you got to do is take out what they don't like. So that's it. Thanks for watching.